Google has one of the most protective operation systems for mobile devices in terms of security features. Android users are capable of using different passcode options, whether it be for lock screen, apps, data, and whatnot. More than that, Android phones also have helpful but at the same time annoying feature that is called FRP, which is, in short, block the ability to use the smartphone after a factory reset. But what if you need to somehow skip Google verification screen after a reset procedure of your Android device. Don't fret, as in this review we're gonna share with you some of the most helpful solutions to do it. Let's get started! Let's start with the explanation what is the FRP feature. FRP is a short for Factory Reset Protection that is a security option on Android devices with Android OS 5.1, Lollipop, and higher. When performing a factory data reset, all settings are returned to the factory default settings and all personal data is erased, including files and downloaded apps. If the Google FRP is enabled, you will need to enter your Google account credentials before you can do a factory reset on the device. Let's imagine that you found your previous Android phone with your former Google account and you don't know password from it, but you need to somehow skip this FRP feature. For the first option, all that you need it is your Android device and stable Wi-Fi connection. Just go to Settings app, then find and tap on Passwords and Accounts menu. Next, on our Account section, tap on the account you wish to remove and afterwards confirm your action by tapping on Remove Account button. Please keep it in mind that if this is the only Google account on the device, you'll need to enter your device's pattern, PIN or password for security reasons. The second option seems to us much more user-friendly, less complicated and requires little or none IT knowledge at all. And this is about DroidKit utility. DroidKit is a complete Android solution for all Android issues including data recovery, screen unlock, FRP bypass, system fix, data management and so on. With the DroidKit you can easily buy pass FRP on various Android devices including Samsung, Xiaomi, Poco, Oppo from Android 6 to 13. Every model has a customized bypassing solution to make sure you can get the highest success rate. You can check more info in our description if you want to get more information. Now let us show you how to bypass Google account with the DroidKit in a minute. Simply download and run DroidKit on your PC or Mac computer, then connect your phone via USB or Type-C cable. In the pop-up window of DroidKit, select and click on FRP Bypass feature. Next, click on Sort button and wait for the configuration files to be prepared. The Android Kit will ask you to choose your Android OS version. Afterwards, follow the instructions in DroidKit application to proceed bypass process. In case if you haven't factory reset your Android phone, please reset it and reach the welcome screen first. Then complete some setups and connect the device to stable Wi-Fi. Afterwards, go back to welcome screen and tap on emergency call. Then enter the code shows in DroidKit and click on reset. When you see Bypass Completed screen, your phone will restart automatically. And here you go! Just so simple as that. Hope that all the tips were kinda useful. Don't forget to subscribe on our channel, like this review and share it with your friends on the social nets. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Peace!